Hey guys, welcome back to the Struggleville YouTube channel. I have some more Harbor Freight coupons to go through with you. This was an email they sent out last night, and it was actually a pretty good one. We had a big price drop on the Hercules Miter saw you're looking at. Had a couple other items go down, but we also had some go up. Uh, but about 30 or so coupons in this email were the best coupon currently available for the items, so that's really good. And I was busy all last night. Uh, doing some other coupons. So between this email and what I got done last night, there's over a hundred new coupons added to the site. I'll get a, a separate post made just for this email, and then the new coupon page will have the coupons from this email and the 75 or so other ones that I did last night. And those were not the coupon catalog for the next month for October because I haven't gotten that yet. Uh, it was just other coupons that I had laying around, so I got caught up on those. Uh, also, we are getting close to the beginning of the month, so the coupon catalog video and coupon all the coupons of that will be coming out, the Inside Track Club coupons and the 10 most searched for coupons video. So we got a lot of stuff going on over the next week or so. It'll be really busy. Let's go through this. And then I have some tool deals to show you that have been uh, posted to my website, struggleville.net. So starting with the miter saw, this is the lowest coupon price. The last coupon was for $3.59, and that was the lowest price also. So this thing started at $400. Apparently, Harbor Freight's realizing that they way overpriced it, and I'm sorry if you were one of the poor suckers who paid $400 for that saw. The Hercules Drill at $99.99. The coupons used to be $89.99, but the last two coupons have been $99.99, so that might be a new normal there. Circular saw, it's always the same price since the only coupon available. The brick saw is the only coupon available. Some coupons are $1.99, some of them are $2.19.99, so we're right in the middle of potential prices on that one. We got the Chicago Electric miter saw, and we have a coupon for $1.29.99 that expires December 7th. The miter saw stand, it's the only coupon available. Used to be $89.99, but it's been a while since we've seen a coupon at that price. The latter, we have another coupon available for the same price that expires January 7th. Way back in March, we had coupons for $99.99, and that might have been the parking lot sale price too, but besides doing the videos for them, I don't track those prices, so I don't remember. Uh, the scaffold, it's the only coupon available and always the same price. The generator... We have a coupon for $5.29.99 that expires December 12th. The truck bed air compressor is the only coupon available, but it's always the same price. The cement mixer to your left is the only coupon available. Usually we only see that as an inside truck club coupon, but it's always that same price. The bigger cement mixer to the right is the only coupon available, um, and it's always the same price. The Concrete Vibrator is the only coupon available, and usually that's only an Inside Track Club coupon also. The 2.2 Vibrator, that's the first coupon we've seen for that item. And the Compactor, we have another coupon available that expires on September 30th, so you have five more days. And that's for $449.99. I checked, the last ten coupons have all been $449.99, and they've raised the price $50 on this new one. So if that's something you are at all interested in, get it before the 30th. And before anyone screams tariffs at me, the stupid Hercules miter saws dropped $100. Where are the tariffs on that one? Do they only apply to plate compactors? Yeah. Okay. Anyway. You know, I did that video yesterday with the, uh, the drill brushes, and I really like the product, but the company is a pain in my ass. Let me tell you, I've dealt with or gone with e gone back and forth in emails with a ton of these different companies now because some things I just decide I don't want to review or I don't want to do it because I either don't care or don't like it or whatever. And then other ones, they've sent me, it's typically like two or three emails. They email me, hey, we have this product. Would you like to do a review and post a video on YouTube? And usually they actually ask for an Amazon review. And I respond back, sure, here's my address. If you want to send me a sample product, go ahead. And then when they ask for Amazon reviews, I say, I don't do Amazon reviews. But if you'd like a YouTube video review, here's a link to my YouTube channel and I can do a video on that. Bada bing, bada boom, they send it to me. I send them a link for the video saying, hey, here's the review. And that's the end of it. These people, 
I would be amazed if I have any less than 25 emails from them. And it's a product that probably costs them $5. They sell it for 20 but come on, after fees and all that, you know, I bet it's less than $5 what it costs them to have it made. And I just get email after email after email. And they really wanted to dictate what I said in the video. And um, they emailed me after it was posted, and they were all mad because I fast-forwarded through some parts. And here's the thing. They want the video under two minutes. They don't want any fast-forwarding. They want me to have an introduction, a conclusion, and use the product in several different instances. How the fuck am I going to do all that in under two minutes? You're goddamn crazy. So then when they were all mad about the video, I'm like, you didn't pay me to do this. What the hell is wrong with you? So I told them if they want me to make any changes to the video, they need to send me $100 first. And uh, I don't, they didn't sound very receptive to that. They kind of sounded mad. I'm like, get the hell out of here. You didn't pay me a damn thing. Do not owe you shit. They kind of made me mad. Okay. Uh, where are we now? Did we do a bandsaw? Oh, there it is. Okay, I almost skipped it. The bandsaw. We have another coupon for... Monica's laughing at me. It's not funny. They made me mad. Usa. Yeah. <laughs> Assholes. All right, the Bauer. Bauer, Bauer, where is it? Bandsaw. We have another coupon available for ninety nine ninety nine that expires January 11th. The Rotary Hammer Kit. No coupon available. Last four coupons were $69.99. The Pro Demolition Hammer Kit, every coupon in the past was $219.99, but this is the only coupon available. So they're raising the price on all of these damn things. The 15-amp Demo Hammer is the only coupon available. It's always the same price. The Professional Breaker Hammer, it's always the same price, and that's the only coupon available. The Brad Nailer, all the way to your left. It's the first coupon Finish nailer right next to it. It's the first coupon we've seen. The framing nailer is the only coupon. Always the same price. The roofing nailer is the only coupon available, and it's always the same price. The trailer. It's the only coupon. Always the same price. If you remember, they didn't have these for the longest time. They had some problem. Apparently, the wheels were shit. And uh, I don't know if they found a new manufacturer for the wheels or what they exactly did. But I've always found it funny that they call this a folding trailer. And I have... I believe this exact one. Mine's 4x8, but I don't remember the weight capacity. I want to say it was 1750, but maybe I'm wrong. But that's folding. And I, I'm almost positive I remember in one of their product pictures, they had it hanging on a garage wall. Like, what the shit's hanging this on their wall? God, man, come on. That's ridiculous. Tell me that's not ridiculous. I'm going to hang my trailer on my wall. Stupid. Triple ball trailer hitch. I'm on one today. I'm getting aggravated. I know. I need a massage. Oh. <laughs> Triple ball trailer hitch. Where the hell is this thing? Trailer hitch. It's the only coupon available. Always the same price. The 64286 is a new item number. So if you're searching for this coupon, use the 61914, and that's when you're where you'll find it. The wheel chalk. It's the only coupon available, usually $5.99, but sometimes we've seen it at $4.99. The weight distributing hitch system, it is the first coupon we've seen on that item. We got the double wheel swing back trailer, only coupon available, always the same price. The trailer dolly is the only coupon available, and the last coupon was the same price. The paint sprayer, only coupon available. It's usually $169.99. Sometimes it's like $167 and $174, but most coupons are $169. Reciprocating Saw. We have another coupon uh, for the same price that expires $12.19. The Bauer Impact. It's the only coupon available, and it's always the same price. The Pressure Washer. We have another coupon available. Same price. Expires January 4th. The Drain Cleaner is usually $299.99, but the last two coupons have been $289.99, and it's the only coupon we currently have. 
And a lot of these, I say it's the only coupon we currently have, and that's kind of a lie, because we have a bunch of these that expire on 9.30, but since all the coupons here expire 10.7, you get an extra week of coverage on these. And instead of explaining that for every single one that is it just, it's the best available. It's easier. Um, the single speed multifunction tool, it's the only coupon available, and it's always the same price. The work light, it's the only coupon available, always the same price. The garden hose, only coupon available, always the same price. The bank's nailer, the last coupon was the same price, and that's the only coupon we have available. It's a new item, so we don't have a lot of history on that one. The Quinn, it's the first coupon we have on the linesman pliers. The hole saw, it's the only coupon available, and the last time they had a coupon for it, it was the same price. The dual-sided drying towel, which I've never seen before, it does say new, but sometimes they're lying bastards about that. But that is the first coupon we've seen on it. Same thing can be said for the bi-metal bandsaw, which is the first coupon we've seen on that also. So, those are all your coupons. I will put a link down below to the best coupons from this email. Like I said, I think it was 31, if I can add. After 20, it gets difficult. I run out of fingers and toes. But uh, let's look at my website here, struggleville.net, and I'll put links to all these deals down below also. We added this stud finder. It's normally twenty one ninety seven. They have a five dollar coupon. Should have put the expiration date. It expires on nine thirty. I'll try to remember to add that after the video. But with the coupon you get it for fourteen seventy two and here's your coupon code. We have a Bosch laser distance measure. It's forty four percent off, was seventy nine ninety nine, is now forty five dollars. Most of the Amazon, so most of the deals in general really don't give you a expiration date. There's only some of them. Usually with the coupon codes are the ones that have the expiration date. A Wilton 4-pound, 12-inch, unbreakable hammer handle. Was $56. Oh, God. A 4-pound hammer for 56 bucks. I'd rather buy 10 of them that break instead. <laughs> of course, if it breaks and hits you in the head, that would be a different story. Uh, it's $27.99. Have the Sears deal again. Spend $75, get $75 back in points. They've done a bunch of similar deals, and we're actually going to do a video. It may be tomorrow's video, depending on what's going on, or maybe two days from now. But I want to show you guys what I did with the first round of Spend 50, Get 50 Back, because some of you may find it interesting. Some of you may take advantage of it, but um, I think it'll at least be interesting to see what happened there. You know, we also have this Craftsman set, the 42-piece set. Uh, we'll take a look at that more in that video. The Minimax Portable Power Pack. So it's like a jump starter, but you can also charge devices. I've actually bought these before at Farm and Fleet. Because Farm and Fleet had, I don't know about the exact same model, but the same Minimax brand. And they had them on clearance really cheap for like $20 two years ago maybe. And I was reselling them, of course, on Amazon for like 100 bucks. But now you can get it for 48 54 I don't know how good it is, but I can say the ones I sold I didn't get any returns. So that's a good good sign, right? The LED headlamp, it's a 2,000 lumen headlamp, rechargeable and waterproof for only $11. And I wanted to check the lumens if it shows on Harbor Freight's website for their headlamp, so one second. So you can see that the Harbor Freight version, it's a much smaller uh, contraption there that's on your head, but it's $11.99 as their regular price, but it's only 310 lumen, so... This one is cheaper, free shipping on Amazon, and you get 2,000 lumens. Much, much brighter, but you have a big-ass like, uh, coal miner damn thing on your head. But, okay, anyway. And then we have a tactical hunting pocket knife with a half serrated blade. It's only $7.39 in free shipping. That's a really good deal if you need a knife. The winch, I thought this was an awesome deal too. The, I don't know, Oxmart? Is that how you, I don't even know how you say it. But it's a 4,500 4, pound electric winch. It's 50% off, expires on 930. So the regular price was $145, but with this coupon code right here, it is only 72.50. So that's an awesome deal. It had somewhat good reviews, pretty good. I guess some people complained about the controller on it, uh, not working or having a problem, but I don't know. It seemed good to me. Milwaukee, MA, I don't know where we left off in the last video. I don't even know how far down this I should go. Milwaukee M18 Fuel 3 8 inch impact wrench with friction ring, 50% off. So the list price is 
Amazon has it for 432, Home Depot has it for 247, and eBay has it for 208.99. So, really good deal on that. That's the end of the page. We're going to call it quits there. There might be more if you go to my website, struggleville.net. Go through a few pages. You will find it. We also, if you're a Menard shopper, uh, if you're not on the email list, then you don't know probably that I have the 11% price adjustment rebate posted. Also, the regular 11% rebate is posted. So if you need to print either of those, you can find them on the website. And I think that's it. Is there anything else, Monica? For those of you who can't see her, which is all of you, she's shaking her head no. And now she's making duck hands. I don't know. Shadow puppets, I guess. I don't know. Shadow puppets. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Give the video a like. Subscribe for an already subscriber. And I will see you next time.